Season 4 faced a lot of backlash, not just because of the rough writing, but because of the secondary plot that didn't affect the main plot whatsoever the entire season. The plot I am talking about is the Sunfire Elves plot with Janai and Kareem. I'm here to tell you that even though it still didn't connect to the main plot in season 5, it actually will. And here's how it does. So, Faros assists Kareem in his adventures to talk to Solaregum and to go around and build an army. I am no assassin. I am the High Priest of Luxaria. Or at least, I was. Faros, could it be you? But what we have to notice is that Faros actually appears in Season 3. And that's very important. Watch the clip. <laughs> Faros gets bit by Sir Sparklepuff as a worm. And you think that's just a throwaway. A throwaway scene. It's, it's not. Because you notice what's on his neck in Season 5? A glowing purple bite. And that's crazy to me, because it means that Eros has been infecting Faros for the past two years and been whispering in his ear like he whispered in Viren's. As much as we love our A-plot with our dragging, Zim, and Bait, the B-plot is Eros's plan B, and his plan A? It failed in season 5. So I'm looking forward to seeing what Faros does in terms of enacting Eros's will and continuing to manipulate Kareem into a war that he might have never wanted. Comment down below for your thoughts on this theory. I've brought you an army. <laughs>